Action. I'm so sick of this family that I'm trying to sell their house. Uh, I keep on telling them to clean up the house. Like it needs to be clean so that when I show all the, you know, customer, the potential buyers, it's an actual clean environment. Action. Let me tell you, I am tired of selling houses for dumbasses. <laughs> <laughs> it's like empty. I can't have some bears. Well, let me tell you. Let me tell you. I have to say. Well, that's it. Fucking hell! <laughs> I be the witch of the wood. It's that's turning out on... so bad. Keep... No accent. No accent. No accent. Well, that is it. That is it. I am done. Fuck. Fucking. It's, <laughs> it's not old yeller. It's old yellow. That's old right, yellow. Man. Old yellow. Old yellow. 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 Old yellow. 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 Candle. French. Candelabra. Candle. Candle. <laughs> yeah. Clean spaces. Clean spaces. I need this space to be clean. I need it to be clean so that I can take people through a walkthrough. Have everything out of the way, everything picked up, so that I can take some beautiful photographs of your home, of your shithole. What the hell is wrong with you? What are you talking about? What the hell is There's wrong with you? You had to give me a little bit more context there. What are these? Where'd you find these? Where did you find these? No, I didn't do these. Of course, no, I didn't do these. Not you. Okay, and what about? What about this voice message? I don't. I don't. Who is that in the picture then? Who is that in the picture? That's not you. Who is that in the picture? I don't know what you're playing at right now, but I don't really don't think it's funny. Really? If I didn't know any better, I'd think I was living with a woman. <laughs> That's good though. It's a good shot, baby. That was kind of scary, wasn't it? Pull because we we were listening to all of the these like uh, we were doing research for this Halloween special and <laughs> listening to these weird ass voicemails and looking at weird ass pictures and just to get inspiration. Then we pull up to the house and there's this weird black cat outside on our front porch. So this mm -hmm. feeling is. Cursed. And I was thinking, maybe I should do an Irish accent for this film. What would you think about that? What do you find scary? The unknown. Something that, I, the, literally the unknown, something that I can't see. What do you find scary? Does that be green? What do you say? Or no, I can handle slashers. More so than supernatural, because I guess it's like you said, the unknown. So slasher films are more. They're in your face. Yeah, I mean, yeah, and there's just blood and guts, and it's that's a slasher film is what it is. It's just good entertainment and supernatural. Kind of, you know, when you're in the bath, uh, if you're in the shower and you're, you know, washing your hair and Someone's you have to close, you. you have to close your eyes. And you start thinking that maybe somebody's behind you or like peeking their head through the shower curtain and looking at you. That freaks me the hell out. Mm -hmm. And I've, I've freaked myself out in our shower a little, a couple of times because I'll look in the reflection and I'll see myself, but it looks like somebody's standing behind me. Top notch. If our, if our acting well, is shit. Well, you definitely don't have then. top notch actors. <laughs> if we're doing with what we can, we're doing with what we can do. Um, but if, if, if my, I'm, I think I'm drunk. Yeah, I think you are. I think I think it might be. Okay, well, can't well, it's, today. I can't say anything. Um, okay, well, I think that you're actually a pretty good actor. Um, there, we 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 filmed that your part, and you're pretty good. Director. But I, I, like I do I do want to be paid two million dollars. <laughs> yeah. Is that your salary for this? Oh shit! Yes. Yeah, um, financing. So uh, you gotta yeah. give it financing about that. You gotta figure out that budget. <laughs> Can I just give you? Oh baby, look at that. See anything you you're, like? You're pretty busty. You're looking busty today. My whole goal is to make this feel like an early 90s, late 80s type horror. 
film um, very stylistically so I want to add a lot of film grain and really get that crackle and pop in there and just from outfit choices to some of the prop choices uh, all of that or you know late 80s early 90s even though this is a very um, this is a story set in present day <laughs> So something that I've never really talked about on my channel is uh, what I studied in college. In, in college, my first year, I went to University of Alabama as a film student, and I was doing that. And after about a year, I switched my major because, I, uh, I don't know, I guess I just psyched myself out. I, I, I doubted myself, and I really was thinking, you know, how am I even going to be able to get a job with something like this? It's not really an attainable career goal. Um, it's not practical, and so I changed my major, and I really wish I hadn't because, you know, film and screenwriting, that was what I loved to do, and that was, I was really passionate about it and excited to go to school for it, and, you know, throughout the years, all the people, all the people I was friends with in those programs, they all went off to, you know, go do internships in LA, and they went to the Oscars and the Golden Globes and all this really cool stuff that I wish I could have been a part of, but... I chose to go a different way, and now I find myself sort of back at square one, back at this initial love for film and love to create, you know. I make YouTube videos, it's not, you know, I'm not making films or anything, but it's still like, it's, it's reignited my passion for filmmaking, because I've been making movies since I was a little kid, I have tons of movies that I made with my friends. So on Skillshare right now, I am currently taking two cinematography classes. If you don't know, Skillshare is one of the best online learning communities. You can find classes anywhere from film to writing to finance or, you know, just you can go on there and whatever your interests are, they have classes for you. You can upload projects and <laughs> all these people for the cinematography class that I'm in, I've uploaded their projects and I'm going through them and they're just so good and everybody's got like, it looks like they've all got really great equipment to use and great sound equipment and, you know, dude, I, that's just not, I don't have that. I don't have, you know, I have my camera, I love my camera and I use my iPhone most of the time for vlogs, but I don't have the best of the best equipment. Skillshare is offering the first 500 people to get two months free and I'll leave that link down below. But now I'm, I'm so, you know, intimidated to even put my little film project in <laughs> with all of these other professionals it looks like everybody looks like a damn professional i don't know i don't know um and it's just all of these are really artsy art house it looks like you know dramatic and just don't fit i don't fit where do i fit in you know i think that's a question we all have rolled in with self-doubt self-deprecation but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep with it because I have goals. I want to. I want to accomplish my dreams. You know, I saw somewhere that Quentin Tarantino had said that he learned how to make movies by making movies. He didn't take classes or anything. He just went and actually made movies, and they were shitty. But he made them and learned how to do everything. And I, I, I completely agree because I've learned so much just doing YouTube videos and sort of honing what I can do and figuring out what I can't do and I think I've been doing a good job keeping myself in a positive mindset and so um, I don't know why though you know I always find myself in a competition with other people and it's not even a real competition it's just I, in my head it's a competition um, you know seeing what other people do and seeing the success they have like by by the time they're my age 23 it, it just it can stress me out but at the same time it gives me that drive you know uh, I don't know, I just want to learn more. I just want to learn more. That's what I'm on. I think I'm on a quest. I'm on a, I'm on a learning quest right now, and I'm trying to figure out how to make everything work. So, go click the link in the description box below. Use the free trial that, uh, that Skillshare is giving y'all, and I'll leave uh, the class that I'm in too so that y'all can go find my little project that I'm uploading. And then, you know, if you like Skillshare after the two month free trial, um, let it roll over into a subscription. It's about ten bucks a month, and it's not—it's not bad. It's a pretty good deal, I think. I'm outside. Look out the window. 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 I'm outside. I'm gonna kill you. Can you 
chez me. I can see you.